Now, one of the things that I don't think gets talked about too much, but is a big part of drill history, and that's Chief Keith and Little Dirk. Right. At one point, they were doing songs together. They were working together. Right. That all ended at one point. Right. What was your thoughts on that when it happened? I mean, shit, you know, like, at the time, it was crazy to see, you know, and... You know, that it was just one of them things where it's like, I, right, you know, you see the guys get into it. At the time, it's like you seeing the guys get into it and shit, you like, oh, damn, what they on? You know what I'm saying? Then when you start looking into, like, who actually right or wrong between the guys, that's when it was, like, for me, like, I was able to, like, you know, just, you know, have my feelings towards the situation with them because it wasn't really, like, shit the most did wrong. It was shit that niggas just be feeling like niggas supposed to did right. Like, you know, like niggas, bro, y'all all all'll be doing some enjoying this shit and niggas will be feeling like you supposed to be doing this with your money or doing that with your money or freeing him with your money or paying for this lawyer with your money or doing that. You know, niggas come with all these expectations of other niggas, folks. And when Sosa was the richest nigga around, everybody got judgment on how he need to go about shit because he the richest. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was almost to a point where a lot of shit was falling on Sosa. And it's like, damn, bro. We got other famous rappers from over here, too. Like, just because my deal was bigger, that don't mean you niggas don't exist on phone them. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, motherfucker be trying to tell you the bottom. Like, where your, your 10,000 on it? You just caught a deal five months before me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I don't work with what I'm working with, folk, but... Like, I ain't like you see the situation that even happened with Fodem. Like, Fodem got into it with Sosa over that shit with Trey Five. They ain't do that shit with nobody else, folk. They went into the nigga they thought had enough money to do all that shit on his own. That's how everybody played him. Like, oh, he the one with the M's. He signed for millions of dollars. Like, we doing this with him for? Let him do it. Like, imagine a nigga that signed for getting into it with you about not doing something for a month. Like, bro, why you ain't do it then? You signed a deal too on BD. Like, why the fuck you over there trying to press me? Like, you ain't got the money to do the shit that you telling me I need to do on BD for folks. You think you doing something? You ain't doing, don't, like, why you pressing me on BD? Why you talking to me? Why you getting in my block business on phone them? Like, you know, shit like that on King David. That's it. So it's like, you know, I just looked at it like, at that point, some shit is going to pass or something on BD, but it was deeper than that at that point. Phone them. Did this have any effects on the hoods or your guys' hood? Or did this make guys have to pick sides? I mean, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Everything, shit like that. When you big dogs, where we from, everything y'all do affect our hood on BD. So, you know, that shit just it affected a lot of people, folks. On BD, it just, you know, because when I, like, like anywhere, anything, once a month, create a divide, now sides come into play. Like, it ain't just like, the initial impact, it's about the 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 out the 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 shit that come after that also. You know what I'm saying? Like once y'all create a divide or any type of division, bro, meaning like I'm on this side, you on that side, now you make that same decision for a whole bunch of other niggas from where we from. Now everybody gotta pick a side. Instead of us being one way all together, the divide between y'all got us divide on BD. So it's like it definitely creates a big ass ripple effect. It's not something that just happens and it's solved or handled cleanly for it, it affects a lot of people. Recently we seen Little Dirk posting on his IG, don't make me post the unreleased. You know, referring to possibly a song with Chief Keith. Do you think they can work through their problems? Man, look, when you homies, when you started off as friends, anything is possible for like Niggas ain't always hated each other. At one point, we all coexisted and loved each other, folks. So when anything is possible, on stay anything, bro. Like it's that shit is definitely possible on Biddy, cause just off the simple fact we all the guys on phone them, like so shit like that always should be possible. Niggas be with the ops and shit, so niggas should be cool with getting cool with their homies. What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button, subscribe. And stay locked in to Cam Capone News.